What's up guys today's video is on the top 5 best cheap gaming laptop under $1000. Through extensive research and testing I've put together a list of options that will meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether, it's price performance or it's particular use. We've got you covered for more information on the products. I've included links in the description box down below which are updated for the best prices like the video comment and don't forget to subscribe now let's get started. Number 1. Acer Nitro 5. A competent laptop for budget gamers. Reasons to buy. User controllable fans good battery life decent gaming performance for price reasons to avoid thick display bezel. The Acer Nitro 5 is squarely aimed at the portable PC gamer who doesn't need every bell and whistle on their machine and might not be able to afford them even if they did. Still, it packs some quality hardware under the hood with specs ranging from the Core i5-10300H GTX 1650 variant, all the way to machines with the Core i7-9750H in RTX 2060 inside. The design has a rather generic gaming laptop aesthetic, however. Number 2. Dell G315. Budget gaming in style. Reasons to buy affordable great performer for the money. Reasons to avoid no USB-C if you're looking to save some cash on your next gaming laptop, the Dell G315 will provide a competent gaming experience while costing much less than the competition. The laptop comes equipped with more than serviceable NVIDIA graphics behind a fine, 1080p display, almost betraying its awfully affordable price point. Just don't expect an overly fancy design or aesthetic, these come with a plastic chassis. For cheap gaming laptops, the G3 range offers a variety of different builds and specs, so it's worth checking out different configurations before you settle. Number 3. MSI GF63 Thin Premium Specs and a Thin Profile at an Affordable Price Point Reasons to Buy Sharp, Colorful Bezel Less Display Very Affordable Brushed Aluminum Top Reasons to Avoid Limited Configurations The MSI G563 Thin is one of the cheap gaming laptops to beat, alongside the Nitro 5 and Legion 5. It generally sits comfortably in the lower price brackets alongside its aft-mentioned competitors but somehow manages to pack everything into an attractive, part metal chassis, a rarity of this price point. Specs are around the ballpark you'd expect with an entry-level machine, starting at a 9th gen Intel Core i5 CPU and an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650, 8GB of RAM and a 256GB SSD. MSI state this design has thin bezels, although don't expect too much with the display on the baseline model, it's still got a chunky bottom bezel and runs at a fairly pedestrian 60 Hz. Number 4. Dell G515 Dell's mid-range competitor. Reasons to buy multiple configurations Solid graphics performance reasons to avoid 60Hz refresh rate on baseline model The Dell G515 is Dell's shot at providing a slightly more upmarket gaming laptop versus the entry-level G315. That said, the baseline models barely retail for more than the G3 so it really comes down to personal taste which one you go for if you're on a budget. The G515s do have a higher potential spec, however, and you'll also be getting a 120Hz to 144Hz display on the more expensive configurations, albeit in a slightly bulkier and still fully plastic chassis. Note, the listed specs here are for the standard Intel equipped machine, although there is also... Number 5. Asus Tough A15 High-End Specs at Mid-Range Prices. Reasons to Buy. The cheapest RTX laptops new AMD processors. Reasons to avoid so-so cooling. One of the shining lights in the mid-range cheap gaming laptop market is the Asus Tough A15, which debuted earlier this year complete with the latest 4000 series AMD Ryzen processors. It's pretty chunky and features a fairly no-nonsense aesthetic that's decidedly budget and outlook in our opinion but we can't argue with the level of specs on offer for the money here. 
It's currently one of the cheapest ways to pick up an RTX 2060 equipped laptop, which retails for around $999, although you can opt for a baseline version that packs a GTX 1660T and goes for around $850. Overall you should expect excellent performance for the money here, although the cooling could be a little better as this laptop runs fairly hot at the